So the first app in this list is Saturation, one of the old Android apps which works on only on rooted Android devices and doesn't matter which device you are using and doesn't matter which Android version you are using, this is one of the best apps. Why is so because you can change the colors of your device and the changes will be applied instantly which is quite interesting one. If you increase the saturation, colors will be punchy. If you decrease the saturation like I did right now, you can see the colors are black and white right now if i change this as you can see colors are quite punchy right now it's totally up to you if you want to increase or decrease it and uh, yes this is so amazing one of the most underrated apps right now out there it it is actually not updated from a long time but the reality is it is working perfectly fine even in 2024 so yes if you want to check it out you can link is already available in the description this is the first android app which is in our list and we are going to talk about around four more or basically three more android apps which works on rooted android devices so make sure to watch this video till the end second app which is in our list is lean droid actually i shared some apps with you already on my other channel but that was in hindi language so a lot of you a lot of our viewers were not able to understand that language that is one of the primary reasons why i am here lean droid as you can see basically if you have enabled this thing which means in background after 10 minutes of inactivity if you are not using the premium version i'm talking about after 10 minutes of inactivity wi-fi cellular data and bluetooth will be turned off to save battery and it's properly or basically totally optional for you if you want your wi-fi do not to be turned off you can disable that option if you want your cellular data to not be turned off so it's totally up to you what you want to choose what you don't want to choose but this is a disable switch which works quite fine third one which is in our list is deblot x this is the app which you can use on almost every oem device for example miui hyper os uh, samsung's one ui vivo oppo etc etc so this is useful in those cases because if you want to deblot your device for example as you can see this is google drive i cannot uninstall this because i'm using a pixel device stock pixel device and these device these apps are pre-installed but with the help of this app because my device is rooted i'm using this app named as deblot x universal so if i choose if i search this click on this i will be able to uninstall this app without having any issues this is one of the primary reasons of using this app the name is deblot x universal and that also works fine in some cases it might not work for you but in most of the cases this should work for you almost for everyone every device every custom room and as you can see it's now uninstalled from my device so i'm able to install it from google play store in case i want to this is just this was basically just an example of google drive but uh, that is not dependent on that last but not the least we have l speed it is also not updated from a long time but basically it brings you some useful thing there there are a lot of tons of things basically available in this app but we are just going to talk about some few of the things for example app cache which you can clean from here you can see how much app cache you have app clashes app catch app cache memory is cleaned here junk files options are also available there and some interesting things are already included but one of my favorite feature which was available in l speed is let me show you if you move on here we have some cleaner options but if you take a look at some junk files you can clean them in case you want to uh, but uh, we have some interesting options available like the boost ram option that is available in miscellaneous tweaks in ram manager you also have the option to customize the ram profile and i'm not exactly sure if it is working fine or not but in miscellaneous tweaks you will find boost scheduler this is quite impressive for example if you choose a time period after that time period as you can see memory freezing memory freebing or you can say the memory will be freed up after a certain amount of time in this case you can manually boost your device in case you want to uh, some in some cases this could be useful in some cases this could not be so it's not guaranteed that it will work for almost almost every device but it could be optional it's quite amazing thing so in case you want to try it out you can all the apps which i just shared with you all the links are available in the description thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one take a look